Della Richardson spoke with Peter Theo Curtis today. Now, he's the U.S. journalist released last week from a different extremist group in Syria. And Rondella joins us live in Cambridge. Rondella? That's right. We saw Theo Curtis uh, twice this afternoon. Of course, as you said, the hostage released by Al Qaeda uh, militants in Syria two weeks ago. And when we talked to him, it was before another American journalist had been executed by ISIS. Curtis was just back from a walk. He stopped, took a few photographs, but refused to talk on camera, expressing concern about the other hostages. Even earlier today, he said, quote, I don't want to say the wrong thing and put more lives in danger. He did say he's concerned about the Europeans and Americans over in Syria. He said their safety is his first priority. His mother, Nancy Curtis, expressed the exact same concern. And then a few hours later, Peter Theo Curtis went for a jog. His disposition, very different, very serious. He even kept his distance. We tried to talk to him about the news of the apparent murder of hostage Stephen Sokoloff, and he did not reply. He just ran into his Cambridge home. He looked very worried, very upset the second time we saw him. And a spokesperson for the family did say that if they do have a statement, it will only be after the video is authenticated by the State Department. Live in Cambridge, Rondella Richardson, WCBB News Center 5.